Hi, y'all. Welcome back. And if you're new, welcome. Hopefully, if you enjoy the video, you will consider subscribing to my channel and come again. Today I'm here. Um, I wanted to do some altered playing cards. I've done, over the past few years, I've done several different types. And they're always a fun project. I haven't made any lately, so I thought I would come on and make some. I made um, these three. I believe it was yesterday. But anyway, I thought we could make some together. I've just collaged and added a few elements. Um, put some coffee dyed paper on the back so that have a little spot for journaling. I think, oops, I forgot to put the coffee dyed paper on that one. Okay, so anyway, I've got a few cards here. So let's just go ahead and get started. Um, let's see, I've just got this little plastic bin full of some of my smaller um, scrap papers. And I've got, uh, I've got this, I've showed it before. I keep some of my small ephemera pieces in here and just some odds and ends kind of scattered around my desk. So let's go ahead and start. Start with this one. I think these cards are so pretty, I kind of hate covering it, but that's okay. All right, let's see. I'm just going to grab out some scrap paper and, and just get started. And again, no rhyme or reason, just getting some papers down, some colors, patterns. Just going to start it right there. Um, what else? This little scrap, maybe. I think I'll use some pink. I've got a couple of small pieces here, and then... Well, I'm just going to start. Sometimes I kind of lay them out and get an idea of what what I want to put where, and other times I just kind of start and see where it ends up. So I guess that's what we're doing today. Um, dictionary page here, might need some of that. Stick. So how's everybody doing today? Hope you're all well. Page from a Daphne's diary. At least I think that's where it's from. It looks like it. One never knows, right? Go ahead and get this down. I haven't had a Daphne's diary in quite a while. From this and see what we're doing. I'm just going to 
little more of this. I'm just trying to remember when the last time I did altered playing cards. I don't even remember. It's been a while, I guess. All right. Do we want anything else? What about a different kind of font? Let me put the top on this. This glue dries out so quickly. All right. Let me... Let's see what we might use. I could use dictionary word or what have we got? got all kinds of little things in here. Got a bird we could use. I'm not gonna don't like how he's fitting. What about this one? Could use that. Let me take a look over here, see what else we've got. Got some little flowers here. Rose. These are from Caroline's Craft Tree. That's kind of pretty. Maybe I'll ink it with some of the worn lipstick. I've really been using this one a good bit lately. It's such a pretty color. down well. It's a little bit heavy cardstock, so. Oops, come back here. dyed paper, just some scrap pieces. So let's tear some of this. Let me 
Might even a little more. Let some more of the card show. Just be enough room to jot a note or something. There. Got some glue on here. I think this Scotch Create should be fine with this. There, I like that with a little more of the card showing. Not a lot of room for journaling, but that's okay. Just a quick note or highlight. So there. All right, let's get another one made. Um, do this card. <coughs> Got some of this bag. I like this print. I sell these damask bags in my shop. I think they're such fun to work with. They're great as bags, of course. You can put them in a journal. Or I like tearing them up and just using some of the paper for collaging or, you know, whatever you want. There. Okay. Just go. Oops, that one's not even going to show. It's going to get cut off. But that's okay. Blue on here. Without gluing it to the book. Or do we want to go that way? Seems like they're not going to go that way. Um, what else do we have? Just never know what your little bitty scraps can end up being used for. That right there. I'm not sure if I've ever done the playing cards as a collage like this. Not that or oh about that or got a little bit of the music paper. Um maybe some of this. on here. Well, I think I put glue on the other end. Try that again. And I want to leave that 10. anything here. I might just rip a little bit off. How's that? Okay, let's trim around here.
there's our base. Now, what do we want to put on this one? Um, let's look around. Got some flowers. Last one of those. No. Don't want that. either. Oh, what a bird. It's kind of pretty. Just ink around it. And these birds are also from Caroline's Craft Tree. Looks like I'm using quite a few pieces of hers today. She always has cute sets. Okay. Let's go for that. Switch over to the Tombow Mono. I like this glue. It works pretty well, but still not as well as the Fabrifix or Fabri-Tac, whichever one I happen to have this time. Pretty much all the same. Okay. There's that one. I think they're cute. What do you think? Do I have another card? No. Oh, yes. I have one over here. Let's do one more. more pink. Yeah, let's do a little more pink. Why not? And we'll go ahead and ink this one with the worn lipstick. to the Scotch Create. Worn lipstick on this one too. And again, I'm trying not to overthink these too much. Sometimes it's so easy to do that. Too overthinking. I mean. Let's see. I don't remember what this paper was from. I don't 
know what I was doing. No telling. But it's good to have scraps, right? Where do I want it? Do I want to go up here? Yeah, if I just do something like that. Get a little bit more of the worn lipstick on here. everything or everything's sticking to me um what do we want to do here I'm looking a little bit over here got some more of these I think this one's a Tracy Fox How about that I think I'm going to get a Stamp and just do a little bit of stamping on here. Get a little bit right on the card. Why not? Okay, do we want this guy? Let me trim it up first. This is another fun little project. Another one of the multi-use things that we can have handy. This would be a cute little tag or journal card. We could put a little tab on the top. Use it for a pocket or a tuck spot. Oh, what am I doing? Yeah. Actually, I think I want oh, my stamp. I get a little bit more. Yeah. Okay. And let's go ahead and ink the sides. Combo on this one. Okay, so there's another one. I just happened to spot this piece of pink ribbon over there. We could even edge it like that, or we could take some of this and make a topper. I think I'm put it down the side, but I'm going to wait until I unclog my Fabrifix and do it because, well, obviously that's fabric and it will hold better. So, here's what we've done. I think these are really cute and really versatile. I'm going to have to get the um, fabric fix, I think, to hold this. But these were fun to make. They're fun to have. Probably make another set, put one in the shop, and keep one for myself. So that's it. Um, I'll go back and put the coffee dyed paper on the back of the ones that it's missing. But that is it for today. I thank you for being here. I hope you enjoyed it. And you will give me a like and subscribe if you haven't. See you tomorrow. Happy crafting.